Hey guys, I'm going to teach you how to play the recorder today. First, I want to go over the parts of the recorder. Your recorder may be a clear color, but I'm using my white one because it's easier to see the holes. The top of the recorder is shaped like this. This curved part is what goes on your mouth. The vent here is what faces out. And then the body has one hole on the back and then three holes on the top, three holes on the bottom, and one on the foot. This is the part that faces away from you. I'm gonna take your left hand, mirror me, you're gonna take that thumb, you're going to put it on that back hole of the recorder. Make sure it covers all of the hole. You wanna use a flat thumb, not the very tip, but the pad part of your finger. So you're gonna put that there. Now you're going to put your first three fingers down. Each hole is assigned to a finger. So your first finger goes here, your second finger goes here, and your third finger goes here. Your fingers never change holes. They always stay over the same holes. Then you're going to put your first finger here, your second finger here, and your third finger here, and your pinky here. This little pinky finger doesn't do anything, so make sure this pinky finger stays up, okay? Your bottom hand, your right hand, is the one that covers more holes. Your top hand covers three on the top and your thumb on the back. Okay, so for your first note, your me, you're going to cover your first hole and your second hole. You're going to leave your thumb here just for balance. Okay, and make sure that your holes are properly covered. Blow nice and light. Try to match the sound. If it sounds like this, you're not covering your top hole or you're not covering your back hole all the way. So make sure your pads of your fingers are covering the whole hole. If you squeeze really hard, when you look at your fingers, you'll see little holes. And those, that's called the donut test. You want your fingers to have those holes. That means that you're covering it the whole time. That's your me. If you put down one more finger, so it's three fingers, you're going to get your ray. Don't blow hard, otherwise you'll sound like this. could also sound like that if you're not covering all of your holes the correct way. That's your ray. And for your dough, you're going to put down all your fingers, including that pinky over there. You're just going to pick up your tall man. So you only have your tall man up. That's your dough. Keep practicing those notes and keep playing nice and light with your breath and you'll be able to play songs in no time.